all love to look at television and see the magical creations from cartoons to music videos. Looking at all the different characters from time to time, we tend to fall in love with them and their costumes and even fantasize to adapt their personality and speak to them in reality. This Bravo Arts has made possible to some extent by presenting heroes and villains body painting exhibition at Thirst Park Churchtown. <laughs> Each of the painted characters represented either a hero or villain from the theatre arena. Managing director of Bravo Arts, Steve Douglas, briefly explained the role of some of the characters. Okay, this is the crazy <laughs> Harley Quinn. Um, we know her from Batman. She's the Joker's girlfriend, but she thinks she's a Joker's girlfriend, but it's, it's in, the, in, in the comics, the joke is always playing on her, you know, and really her, always hurting her feelings. But in the end, she always fall for the Joker again, right? From the uh, Spider-Man movie, his Venom. It's something that gets on you. That's what the Venom is, right? When it gets on you, based on your character and so forth, then it doesn't transfer, but it brings out the dark side of you. This is our character from the X-Men movie and her name is Storm. Alright, she's the woman, she controls the weather, she does uh, the lighting and so on. So she's she's well respected as well. Very strong woman. She's wearing um, contact lens to give her because when their movies when Storm actually starts to control the weather, her eyes turn to white. So with the contact lens is is to give her that white um, white out effect. All right, so we're looking at Hulk here, the Incredible Hulk, and he's a huge monster. <laughs> um, and so we took this one from the comic books, the, the Marvel comics, and we did the, the pants and everything, we did the sewing too. We tried to get it as tight, because you know when Hulk, he's a normal guy, but whenever he gets into his mood, <laughs> he then turns into this big strong guy, and then he tears up everything. We picked in Poison Ivy here, and she's uh, very famous in the in the movie Batman or the, the comic series Batman. As a matter of fact, we took it, the, 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 con, the whole page here that we, we took it from the comic book. And if you've ever seen a movie, The Incredibles, and that's a family that has Mr. Incredible, Mrs. Incredible, and the kids, Flash, and this is Violet Parr. A lot of you don't know her name, right? Uh, but she's from The Incredible movie. She's a, she's a uh, daughter of the Mrs. Incredible. Yeah, and so this is the piece we tried to create and we tried to get it, everything as uh, detailed as possible. Even we here with a man of steel, <laughs> Superman, and he got some muscle packed on there. <laughs> um, of course, this is from the comic as well, and Superman, there isn't much um, altering to the characters, um, even in the movies. So this is a really good piece put together by our artists. And if you're a big fan of Star Wars, you're looking at Darth Maul and Darth Talon, all right? They're from the Star Wars movie. You no, know, people don't know much about uh, Darth Talon, but she's from the, she, you find a lot in the comics, you know? And um, the two popular characters, this, they're kind of, you know, boyfriend and girlfriend story going on here. <laughs> and for those who are curious about painting heroes and villains, Bravo Arts painted a Guyanese hero right on scene, who was dubbed Arrowhead by the crowd. Thank you.